Good morning everyone and welcome back to our channel. Workout done, shower done. December is starting. We already showed you the Christmas lights. Yesterday we talked about traditions. So there are two things missing, which are Christmas decoration and food. So the next two days, that's what we are going to show you. Yesterday I spoke in Portuguese and well, it was a challenge, but I'm willing to do it every day, not on YouTube. But if you think that my Portuguese is better than Maria's, just comment. <laughs> and today's plan is what Maria just told you, so let's get going. Let's go. The first step for Christmas decorations is go to the attic and find the boxes from last year. Let's do this. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This is tricky. <laughs> A mais. <laughs> <laughs> Ai meu Deus. Many more. Many more. Are you kidding me? No. <laughs> I told you. It's a full day job. It's everything that is inside this box. <laughs> they take it pretty seriously. <laughs> Everything is downstairs now, and let's get this ready. Bye. Last year we were in a 30 meter square apartment in Barcelona, so the only thing that we had was a neon Christmas tree. So I think this year will be an upgrade. Alright, the boxes are here. Now let's start with the living room. We're going to show you the before and after and our process. <laughs> let's go, let's start this Christmas makeover. Dewey is not used to do this. He says that at his home they stopped doing the Christmas tree a long time ago. So I'm teaching him everything. <laughs> I never had this sophisticated trees. <laughs> So, first phase complete, the tree is up okay. and now we are going to decorate it. First the lights and then the ash ball is not out. Family activities! Do you want to No. Muito bem, isso é que eu tinha sido essas palavras. De cima não fui o que te ensinei, foram amigos meus. Estou feito ali. Sorry for not vlogging the meal, but we were pretty hungry. But yes, we ate uh, arroz tamboril. Mm -hmm. Tamboril is a fish and it was delicious. I love this winter dishes. <laughs> and now because Portugal is a Catholic country, we are going to do the nativity scene at the house. So we need some moss and we are going to find it. Let's, Let's go. go. We need vegetation to our nativity scene. This is gonna be a tree, right? Yes, not a Christmas tree. Oi! Oi, se desci, se é um pouco. 
Tem este bocadinho, Maria. Mas tem bicho. Tem um bicho lá dentro! Viram? <risos> All right, so we just got home and now we're gonna start with the nativity scene that is called in Portuguese presépio. Presépio. And well, I don't know how they do it in Maria's house, so let's find out. Yeah. <laughs> this is for the structure of the nativity scene, but I have to confess that I need help from my mother because <laughs> she's an architect and she understands this better than I do. <laughs> I think they're trying to make a city. <laughs> The structure is done. done. Wow. This is our cave. Then we're going to cover it. And last thing is the little figures. So this is typical from Stromos in Alentejo mm -hmm. and now it's time for them to go to our nativity scene. Mary, Joseph, Jesus, the kings and the pastors. Oh there's baby Especially Jesus, me. super cute. He lost an arm, but this was the nativity scene that I did in school. How old were you? Mm, ten. Really? You have the baby Jesus. <laughs> oh my god, poor baby Jesus. I don't have a future. No. As, Doing... an, as an artist, no. Sorry. No? <laughs> I tried. Vias de gravar a ti a ver se estás a gostar destas tradições de Portugal ou não. Estou a gostar. Estou a gostar imenso. Qual é que foi a tua parte preferida? A verdade é tudo. A estrutura, a população. E não estavas à espera que fosse desse tanto trabalho, pois não? <risos> não. So, finally, <risos> the nativity scene is ready. And this is new, my new contribution this year. <risos> So, we're finally done. It took us several hours to finish, but, but finally we made it. Yes, thanks to Maria's mom for the help. And the most important thing of today was enjoying this family time. It reminds me of my family, miss them a lot. And well, yeah, this is what Christmas is all about, family and traditions. So I hope you like it. And tomorrow I think we're going to cook something.